Hello, Tony Ray is here. This is the Copella Razor Sharp Serbian Carbon Steel Chef Knife. It is a really good knife and with a lot of wear and tear with this knife you can simply see how much I use it and love it. However, some may think different and say, is it actually worth it? Well, stick around and chill and come with me to see what we can do with it. This chef knife is forged by hand. We will go over design, durability, performance, price, maintenance, details, and my personal conclusions. Again, I enjoy sharing my personal experience and thoughts with all of you. So thank you for visiting. You guys are awesome. Design specifications. Blade made of carbon steel, steel iron, mild steel, and manganese, blade edge of three convex layers, length at 7.8 inches, not dishwashable safe, and weighs an approximately one pound. We'll talk about durability. So if I was to do a vertical measurement, it's about one foot one inches. 3.8 millimeters is about the thickness. And if I was to get the overall width of the area, it's about six inches in length. What this has is a handle here that fits on the belt pocket. I don't know if you can see it, but once you put it on the belt pocket, it sort of dangles here and you could actually use it whenever you need to when you're out camping or hiking. It is important to know this is a knife forged from high carbon steel and high manganese steel. Because it has high manganese, it's very hard for carbon steel to split like a crack. Facts, high carbon steel has a better integrity and has the ability to maintain sharp edges than stainless steel. Quick note, it is not made of stainless steel, so after each use, you need to keep it clean to keep its integrity and durability. <laughs> that was pretty cool. Also, wear resistant, effective cutting and strength on the blade is provided by high carbon steel. All right, we'll go over performance. To reiterate, because the knife is rapidly heated at 1,650 degrees Fahrenheit, give or take, through a hot furnace, it makes the forging process easier to shape and design. The performance and quality of the three layer high carbon steel helps promote the blade with the ability to maintain sharpness for a very long time. So given my performance review, I will give it a 9.9. .9. I think that's fair, yes. Now let's go over price. I got this at Amazon for about $112, give or take, depending on the state that you live in. And I think it's a great investment because of the way the handle is built, the way the stitching is put together, the way the buttons are actually nice and sturdy, and the leather design itself, um, you know, with the belt hook, really works really well. These strings here, I kind of use it to wrap around my leg in case I'm going up a hill. It just keeps it in place from it going up and down, but it has never fallen. It's always stayed secure. Again, for $112, it's a heck of a deal. There's many knives out there. I got this from Amazon. I will leave the link in description below uh, with an array of different knives selections there's so many different specifications you could get with your knife whether it's carbon stainless steel whether it's ferrous or non-ferrous the periodic table is never ending so get the knife that works great for you if i can make a small recommendation try this one i think this serbian chef knife will suit you well 
So for $112, I think it's a good deal. Okay, let's go over maintenance. So it's not very hard to maintain any knife. Um, you know, it's well equipped. So what I like to do is that I have these uh, sharpeners that I had in my shelf and you can simply sharpen it, you know, with any kind of sharpening tool that you can use. I have another one here that has a fine and a coarse type of sharpener, but a lot of people like to use a block where they could actually sharpen their knife at a nice 30, 20 degree angle. Always move away towards the body, safety rule. For you to keep this knife in good shape, it requires very little maintenance, but it does need to be saturated with light oil. So it comes with a cloth here. So right after every use, just kind of, you know, just keep it moist and clean and make sure that uh, you keep it saturated with oil. So I think the integrity and the longevity of this knife is very good. So it's easy to maintain, easy to keep clean, and it will last you a long time. So let's go over a few details. Uh, from the beginning, I mentioned that this was about one pound, so it's not too heavy. It's very ergonomic. I love the belt clip here. The buttons work really great. It's a good quality steel because it has carbon steel and manganese. Those two there make the grade on this specific knife. And remind you, because it's a convex layers, it's thick right here in the back side where it thins out as a bevel, which has to be hand forged, so thick to a convex. I love this knife because it's more of a medieval crusades. You look pretty cool when you're out there and someone's looking at you, sees this on your side. They kind of compliment you like, that's a great knife. And, and they know that you mean well because you know, you're out there, you know, with your camping gear. So I don't think I would worry about that. Remind you, this is about $112.95, depending on the state that you're in. I did see some other prices that were a little bit different in, in Amazon. So do your due diligence and check. Make sure you're not over pain. I love the handle. The handle again is rosewood handle and it's a classic grade so it looks really nice. Um, this is a oil tanned leather sheath. It's stitched really well. I think it's really good and remind you this is not dish washable at all so do not put this in the dishwasher. Clean it with a rag and oil and you'll be good. All right well that's details. All right, my overall conclusions. Having this knife for two years, I think I have a little say-so here. <laughs> if I had it for a month, there's not much I could say, but it has served me well. If you have a really good knife skill set, it will benefit you significantly. Whether you wanna cut chicken or steak, this is the knife. If you found this video helpful, please like and subscribe. That would help the channel so much. Well, that concludes my presentation. Thank you for watching. I will see you on the next one.